A little boy took the wheel in a major way and ended up saving his grandfather's life, his own, and countless others. Yeah, he tells Atlanta News First, saw your bussy, he did what he felt was right. If you were 10 years old and your diabetic grandfather went unconscious at the wheel, would you have known what to do? Hey, did I I got there in Tennessee. We were on the side of the road. I pulled him over. I, I, I muffled him. I pulled him over on the side of the road. Okay, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, I pulled him over on the side of the road. We're, we're at the side. It says the cycle. We'll say it. And it's exit 320. We're right at exit 320. Drake Lynn did know what to do. Drake was able to grab the steering wheel and drive the two to safety. But keep in mind, they were on the highway when this happened, going about 70 miles an hour, and they were carrying a boat. All the stuff is going through my mind, like, what's going to happen? Are we going to get in a wreck or what? But it worked out perfectly. That was just remarkable. I mean, it was just amazing. Probably one of the most touching calls that I've took since I've been at 911. Today, he was honored at the Gordon County Sheriff's Office for his bravery. Your actions on Monday, the 15th of July, 2024. Drake's family tells me they're guessing he knew how to take the wheel because of his time on the farm. What an extraordinary young man that, that took a dangerous situation and made it safe for him and his grandpa. I like it because I did something that could save a lot of people's life on the interstate, and that's something that Biter man or somebody would do, so, yeah. In Gordon County, Sawyer Bussey, Atlanta News First. What a brave little guy. And pulling a boat, I don't think many adults would know how to handle a vehicle like I that. I can't drive a no. vehicle with a boat behind mm -hmm. it, and yet that 10-year-old saved a lot of lives mm -hmm. just making that.